Well, um, I want to thank you for my first ever video reply. Thank you. I appreciate it. It also um, enticed your friend, uh, Tablet Junk, to post one. So thanks to him, too, I'm actually getting video responses, and I think that's very cool. Anyway, I wanted to tell you about your friend drinking. Um, yeah, you did the right thing, I think. I think that, you know... But I think you should be truthful with him and let him know that you think he has a problem. But the only thing is, I'm a former alcoholic myself. And the truth of the matter is, he's not going to stop until he's ready. You know? I mean, it took me actually going to a Putz and Falcons concert and injuring myself to the point where I couldn't walk the next morning. Um, they were playing with the boils, and um, I just for some reason went ape shit when the boils played Moral Crusaders. I don't know if you're familiar with the boils or that song. Oh, shit. Um, moshed around the pit. Decided to try to leap onto stage and miss the stage and fell on my leg and could barely walk. Um, I had to get carried out of the club by two of my friends and um, then I had to go and I was on crutches for two or three weeks after that and you know that's when I kind of figured out hey I better stop this plus I met my wife I mean of course she wasn't my wife then but um, you know, and she doesn't really drink, so that kind of helped me as well. So, as for your friend, I mean, I mean, try to be a good influence and try to be truthful with him, but, you know, I don't think really he's going to change until he wants to. So, but, um, yeah, I mean, don't include him in any more drinking outings. Definitely don't. You know, try not to enable it at all. That's the best advice I can give you. All right.